Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And for today's video, we are gonna to be touring LMU. This is just one of the campuses we're gonna to be touring while I'm trying to figure out and plan where I wanna go for the next two years. I decided I wanted to film this college campus tour series for students that are planning to transfer or going straight into a four year after their senior year of high school. Sometimes it's hard to see every single campus you're planning to apply to. So I thought I would film some of the college campuses that I'll be going to and giving you guys feedback on what I think the campus is like and student life and just overall a view of what it was like to be on campus and i hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get into it good morning hi guys hey my hair <laughs> so um I thought I would take you guys because this is the first time I'm actually going to go and look at some universities to transfer to um, after I'm done with school. I'm so excited and it already says my camera's going to die. So I might have to film on my phone or something. But um, yeah, I wanted to take you guys with me. We're going to go look at LMU today. Um, it's one of my top choices. Um, it's up there. I met them at a college fair and after that I ended up really really liking them so we're gonna go i'm so excited i want to take you guys along and later on next month we're gonna go somewhere into another college so i thought i want to take you guys when we go and look at the colleges and kind of get a feel especially for students that are either graduating high school or thinking of transferring kind of gives you like a video to look at for tours so I'm gonna charge my battery because it's dying I'm gonna charge it really fast so I can film on here I'm so excited to take you guys I'm so excited to go on campus and see what it's like because this may be the future school that I'm at and that you guys will be coming with me so yeah let me charge my battery because it's literally about to die <laughs> see you guys whenever I, I pick up the camera again hey we just finished the lighting's terrible, you can't even see me. My camera's about to die, but overall consensus, I love it here, and we'll go more in detail at home. So I'll see you then. <laughs> We're back from the LMU trip, and I thought I'd give um, an honest review and how it went for my first like actual university college tour. Um, if you don't know, I am currently a... What am I? <laughs> I'm currently a sophomore in community college and um, I am planning to transfer soon. So I thought I would take you guys along this journey because I feel like the next two years I really want to film for you guys because that's when I'm going to be actually at a university. Right now um, in community college I really buckle down because I really want to get good grades to get into a really good university obviously so i really buckled down but i feel like once i'm there i'm gonna like want to be a part of clubs and also there was quarantine so it's not like i could really go on campus even now there's not that many uh classes on the campus um at the community college i'm at now only one class um i have in person so um with that being said that's kind of why the college content's been weird because the past two years were um a lot just for everyone um so yeah i want to like show you guys i'm gonna do like a college acceptance video like all that stuff is gonna be coming soon and i just really want to show you guys this process because it is stressful and it is nerve-wracking and it is overwhelming and i want to show that it's okay to have these feelings um but yeah that's a little take on what's to come for my channel um but yes i want to talk about lmu so let's let me talk about lmu now <laughs> I just spilled all over me. All right. Well, anyways, LMU is a beautiful campus. And if you're one of those students that loves small, um, a small campus, first of all, a smaller campus, not small, a smaller campus and also smaller classes, then this is probably the college for you. Personally, I like having smaller classes because currently in community college, I have a really good relationship with my professors. They're easy to contact. Um, if I need help, emailing's easy and respond really fast. They, I just have um, created such a good relationship with my professors um, to this point. 
point and I feel like going into a university I want to be extra um, have like even more of a relationship with my professors because they're gonna be teaching me what I'm gonna be doing out in the world so I want to get as much information if I'm confused it's easy to access um, act, like just to talk to them and kind of pick their brain about whatever I'm majoring in so if you're one of those students that likes really one-on-one -on -one and um, truly just loves asking questions and I think this is probably the university for you. Um, three college or three students that are currently at LMU spoke um, to some of us transfer students that went to the um, tour. Um, talked to us about what campus life is like. There's so many clubs. Uh, one thing that I did really enjoy hearing is um, all their relationships with their professors. Obviously they said their professors respond fast, their classes are small, so they really have one-on-one -on -one, one with the professors and it shows that their professors are really focused on them to help them succeed in whatever they're trying to do. So I do really like that. Um, overall, the transfer counselors and um, just like staff was so extremely nice and helpful um, and very welcoming and wanting to help. Like one of them, just emailed me about some stuff that I asked uh, questions about and she emailed me um, already. So, you know, it kind of gives, just gives off a really good vibe of like just wanting to help each other. Everyone on campus, just like students walking around, were just so nice and um, very welcome. Like everyone was just smiling. Like it was honestly such a relaxing and very safe um, environment to learn and grow and it makes me feel a little bit more comfortable making mistakes because I'm the type of student that does not like to make mistakes. Um, but I felt like even if I did make a mistake there, everyone would try to help me, lift me up, and I just overall really like the vibe. Um, I live in the desert. <laughs> it's really hot where I live now, so um, going to LMU, the weather would be way cooler. If you're in a really, really hot, dry place, the weather there is so nice because the campus is literally seven minutes away from the beach and super close to the city. As you saw in some of the clips, you can see that there was the ocean and then on the other side, there was the Hollywood sign. So you're still very, well personally, I'm very local um, and I like that. I was thinking I wanna go out of state, which I might want to, but um, I kinda got too comfortable and I kinda wanna stay in state in California, stay close to family um, because I just love my family so much that I feel like it would be really hard to go out of state but you never know. You never know what can happen. But I do like that it is so close. It's literally like an hour away from uh, from where I live now and like 30 minutes away from um, Hollywood. So I'm still like very close and easy to get home if I need a little, if I'm getting a little homesick. You know, I'm terrified of being homesick. But um, overall, um, if you go to LMU's website, they'll give you all the information there. But everyone was just so helpful. The campus is beautiful. Housing seems cool. They have a Starbucks there. <laughs> they have just so many um, cool little aspects that I didn't know about. And of course, I'm like, I want to go to LMU. Um, it is one of my um, choices. Of course, I do want to apply there. And I just, I just had a really, really good time there. Um, but I don't know. Um, oh, the one thing they don't have. I was trying to think of stuff that they don't have. Um, one thing they don't have is a football team. They're athletic. Um, they just don't have a football team. They have a basketball team and a volleyball team, a soccer team. We actually saw the soccer field, which was really cool. It was like above, like a soccer field, like practice field, I think it was. Above the parking truck. It was just so cool. Um, the library is huge. Uh, there's so many things I wish I could have filmed, but I got shy and I was mainly listening so then I can come back and talk to you guys about this. But yeah, I really like LMU. We are going to go towards some more colleges, so my mind might change, but at the moment LMU is just one of my faves so far. Um, it's also the first one, so that's why it's one of my faves because it's the first campus I've um, seen besides like USC. But I've been to USC and I've been to UCLA. Um, but that's another one that I was like not expecting to love so much. Um, so yeah, we have um, a few more colleges I want to go look at. Um, next month we're going to go 
out of state to visit a college, which is kind of exciting. Um, it's not one that's like on my top list, but I thought it would be fun to take you guys, especially if you're watching this and I'm planning to uh, transfer or you're graduating from high school and or you took a gap year and kind of like, I don't know what I want to do. This was my honest review. Honestly, there's more, there's so much more that they uh, told me, but I don't want to make this video super, super long, but I keep saying but and um, and I'm so sorry. But I just had such a good time on campus. I really, really enjoyed it. And this is getting me excited to um, go to whatever university I plan on going to. But LMU was great. It's such like, the vibes are just immaculate. And it was just positive vibes all around. Our tour guides were so nice. Students were so nice. I actually got one of the girls' numbers um, that talked um, to us about what they do on campus and how they feel about just being um, an LMU student. And she was so nice and so just like, was like, yeah, just text me whenever if you have any questions. And when she was talking about what she was majoring in and what she was doing on campus, I was like, that's exactly what I want to do. So I wanted to get her info and she was so open and um, just super nice. So I had such a good time. This, the start of my campus tours has been a success because this was the best. It's, I'm saying this is the best tour I've ever had, even though it's the one. But so far, it's the best tour I've ever had. Oh, I can't talk. This is the best tour I've ever had, and I love the campus, and I love the people, and I love the staff, and I just love all of it. So I really enjoyed it. You know, things might change. This is just the beginning of me going and applying and looking at colleges. So this is just one. And also, their deadline for fall 2023 transfers is February 1st, I think. So I do have a lot of time, and that's also why I like it. I have a lot of time to send in my application and make sure that everything is up to the T. So now hopefully, I get accepted in. Um, yeah. It's getting me so excited for more campus tours and to take you guys along. I actually had such a fun time. Hopefully next campus tour, I'm not super shy and I try, I'm gonna try and film as much as I can. But you guys just got a glimpse. I wish I could film the whole thing, but people would probably be staring at me and I'm scared of vlogging in public. I'm trying to get more comfortable. But yes, I had such a good time. Yes! I'm so happy. But um, Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. And if you made it this far, um, comment the backpack emoji. No one comments. I'm just joking. <laughs> comment the backpack emoji if you made it this far. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your week. And until next time, do you, be you, and stay true. And I will see you guys next time bye i'm so happy <laughs>